What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. It's me, Keegan, of course, and let's get right into the It's Keegan 2020 YouTube Rewind. So we're watching the coronavirus news in class because today is the last day of school for about a month and a half. Trayvon! Trayvon! Do it! <laughs> the next one says, you're really cute, have a great personality, crazy sweet, I honestly wish I could ask you out, but I don't know if you'd like me like that, in that way. I'm single, might as well hit me up, start talking to me more, I don't know who this is, but you're gonna have to, might as well shoot your shot sometime. You feel proud or something? Yeah. Says hello. I need a baby to be my companion text buddy. Loyal and trustworthy. Someone I can talk to. I'm not all about the fun. That's what it says. So I need a real person. I'm a real person. So I was at the store the other day and I've been talking to this company for a while. And we got us on a box and we got on a box. Oh no! <laughs> oh! What the heck is that? That's us. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh, you did that yourself. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, look. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> oh, my <laughs> man. Is that what? Oh, you look good, but I don't know. No, it's you. Yeah. <laughs> the next girl said, I would rate you an eight and a half. Eight and a half. And yeah, you are cuter than my ex. Your exes are pretty damn sad then. It doesn't move. One of the last ones says, Kegs, our relationship is like Tom and Jerry. We tease each other, knock each other down, irritate each other, but we cannot live without each other. I miss making fun of you, best friend. Guys, this is my best friend. She wrote this. Um, it's all true. We got a crazy friendship. She's crazy. I'm crazy. We get along like that. Someone's gonna come out of Just path. do it. And I also started screenshotting all the chats, like the ones you're seeing on the screen, before they could block me. And they started getting all mad. And the last thing they said to me was, like I said, I need to block you with all this wrongdoing. And all I replied was, was say hi to YouTube. Uh -huh. Crazy. <laughs> what? Uh, okay, now here's the uh, here's the bad news. <laughs> you gotta get off that the screen. What's the bad news? Bad news. I was pretty close. I just resigned from the FBI. So you're telling me I'm talking to an FBI agent now? So I'm sorry, gonna call her right now. Let's just try it, I guess. Cause I know she's she has her phone with her. I know she does. You see. It is ringing again. Hello, this is a collect call from Washington State Jail for inmate Keegan McVeigh. Say yes if you would like to accept. Keegan, you did not. This is a prank. I know this is for like a YouTube video or something. I did actually get a reply. Sadly, I only did get one reply out of this which i was really surprised because i thought a lot of them would actually replied and i asked him tell me a joke like i did everyone else and he replied back within three hours and told me to suck it it's keegan aka the dude <laughs> With 789 subscribers, it's actually 791. It went up overnight. On the way to 1,000, congrats with a 3.5 somehow. It's not GK, but let's go. <laughs> Thank you. What the? <laughs> I'm blinged out. <laughs> you got a gold chain, though. You said you wanted a gold chain. I don't know if this counts as gold. It's gold. Gold in. Standing with one of the guys. He's coming up right now. Oh, on the. Oh, I'm going to show 
Congratulations! They did it! Next one is, and you guys will be able to see on the screen, it is most coins stacked into a tower in 30 seconds. The current world record is 51. The rules is any coins that carries a max of thickness of 3 mm, I don't know, whatever mm stands for, millimeters or something, I don't know, may be used. Through only one hand can be used, so that's actually going to be a lot harder than I thought. With the other hand held behind his back. At the end of 30 seconds, second period. At the end of the 30 second period, <coughs> period, they must remain standing for five seconds. So that's going to be a lot harder, only using one hand. I do have rolls of pennies here. Don't ask how I got all these pennies. It's a long story. But let me unravel all these and we'll get right into it. So as you guys can now see, I do have a pile of pennies right in front of me. That sounded really weird, but whatever. And I'm going to do a one minute timer on my phone to hopefully stack all the pennies and we're going to get right into it. Three, two, one. And that is pretty much time right now. It's pretty obvious that I'm not going to fall in, so let's count how many I got. Just drop them. One, two, 24, 25, 26, 27. So I only got... 27. I think the record was 50 or 51. Uh, another number from my brother's phone. Um, this guy used to be in my math class. He's chill with me. He knows me. It's just how much does he care about me now if he answers the phone? Because if, if any of these people would answer already, like it would be such a good video. It's just they have to answer. Hello? Hello. This is a Glad call from Washington State Jail for inmate Keegan McVeigh. Yes, if you would like to accept. Where what? Hello, this is a direct call from Washington State Jail for inmate Keegan McVeigh. Yes, if you would like to accept. Daniel is now calling Josh to see what's going on and we're going to answer it. Yo, Josh. What? Bro, he's been gone for the past few hours. Wait, what? Yeah. He's actually falling for it. He's been gone the past three hours. He said he. Yeah. How the hell did he get? How the hell did he call me? I didn't even give him my phone number. I gave him your number somehow. You gave him my phone number. Is he in jail right now? What the hell's going on? I guess so. How? Wait, you don't have his number? If the cops have his phone. Oh my god. I've joined two Sugar Mama dating app or dating apps or sugar how to get a Sugar Mama app, whatever you guys want to call it. I'm gonna start the screen recorder right now. I have to be careful on these apps because most of the time there's someone's face. But the only thing is a lot of these people on here are scammers or um uh, some of them like to be called escorts, which is mostly a prostitute. Past month, every single day, I've been doing some of the most uncomfortable stuff in the whole world. For the whole month of August, every single day, I did something uncomfortable, or some people call it discomfort. Whatever, either one you want to call it, it works fine. Um, some of the most simplest things I did that were still uncomfortable to me, to actually some of the really hard and really weird things. That were still really, some of it was just really uncomfortable and really weird. Right today, 10 guys, today's discomfort is I'm actually going to be reading a book. Sad, sadly as that sounds, if you guys know me in person, you guys know I don't like reading at all. So I'm going to set a 10 minute timer on my phone starting in about 10 seconds or whatever. I'm going to read for 10 minutes and that will be today's discomfort. Right, for today's discomfort, honestly, <clears throat> I don't know what day it is anymore. I'm really getting, I'm starting to lose track of the days because 
I don't know. This, this, this has been a really long month because of this challenge, but today is we're going to go compliment someone. My brother's just in the other room. We're going to go compliment his shirt or something. Just because it's, it's easy, but people, a lot of, I feel like a lot of people don't give other people compliments, like the simplest stuff. So let's go do it. Gosh. Nice shirt. Alright, so we have made it to the very end of the month, August 31st. Today is my birthday, guys, so if you could drop the cake emoji down below in the comments, it would mean a lot to me. Just wish me a happy birthday. It would mean a lot, but today, um, no, I'm kind of nervous. Um, I'm going to be trying sardines for the first time. I've heard a lot <clears throat> about sardines and how they smell bad, taste really bad. Um, the garbage is right there, just in case if I throw up. Um, I'm really nervous. Like, now you're going to lie. I'm really nervous. Why am I doing this? <laughs> okay, we got a small piece. This is what I'm gonna try. Oh, I wish you guys could. I wish you guys could smell it. It smells like a seafood, a seafood dumpster, but like, ugh, ten times worse. Got a small piece. Um, I'm just gonna screw it. This isn't it. Yeah. Oh, trust me, I got a YouTube channel. I'll do it. Yes. <laughs> I got it. already caught some of them. Where are they? You know? We don't know. Oh, we don't know. Uh, yeah, like mean. half an hour ago, they started fucking with our neighbor's stuff. Uh, uh, I have no problem. Yes, you're the man. All right, I'm going to load you up. I just got Josh into the room. He has not seen it. His eyes are covered this entire time. He hasn't opened them at all. Josh, open them up. Man, come on, man. I'm good. What's up, Mr. G? Doing all right. Good uh, to hear. Uh, was that Squidward behind you there? He really, the teacher really asked, is that Squidward? Bro, what does it look like? What, like, come, what do you think? So Josh is off to about the first two, two and a half layers, I want to say. He, it took him about, I'd say two minutes. He took, it it's took him true. about two minutes. How do you know? <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Hold on, what? It's shoes. How do you know? Shaking it? Sh whoopee, anything could be. I wanted shoes. Oh, come on. <laughs> So technically, it is kind of Friday. So I was talking to you guys just a second ago. Josh is opening the gift. He shook it. <laughs> shook it. I wrapped it. Remember, you guys saw how I wrapped it. I wrapped it really good. You shouldn't be able to tell what's inside. He, Josh, shake it, shake it. It's shoes. How? He's damn sexy.